Welcome, Sagittarius. Let's go ahead and get your oracle. Ooh. You got fate. Look at that. Some cards. Coincidence. Fatalism. Fortune telling. Oh, wow. So, y'all watching readings and stuff? <laughs> Something is meant to be. Something written in the written in the stars is meant to be here. You see those zodiac symbols in the back? Something is meant to be. You realizing that something is meant to be, Sagittarius? What are you realizing? You could be born December 4th, December 10th, December 1st, December 20th, November 24th, December 14th. You got an idea? So you have an idea based off of fate, based off of something that you see, something that you hear. Okay. So you're thinking of a master plan dealing with something. You're coming up with some type of master plan, Sagittarius. Hmm. What is this master plan dealing with, Sag? What is it dealing with? You have some type of realization about something, Sag. Some type of realization that you have. Entertainment. Oh, some of you could be in the entertainment business. Well, you could be thinking about entertaining a certain situation or person. Let's get one more. Ooh, dessert. Oh, my. Internal work. Healing. So Sagittarius, I see that you are doing some type of healing work internally on yourself, especially with this fate. I see fate here. So you could have got some type of spiritual uh, guidance through a reading. Or you could be getting through this reading and you have an idea regarding entertainment or regarding entertaining a certain situation or person. But then I see dessert here. So I'm getting this is dealing with another person. You could cook. Some of you are cooks or you bake. Okay. Or you enjoy baking or you like eating dessert. Something. Something dealing with dessert. Something is good here with entertainment. We're going to find out exactly where this energy is coming from. And break this on down for you, uh, Sagittarius with Tarot. Why is dessert here? Why is this right here for Sag? Something is good. <laughs> Something is really good. Oh, you got, oh, wow. I kind of figured it was dealing with some type of love situation because, oh, we, when it came out, especially along with entertainment, I just feel, feel like you're, maybe you're entertaining a certain situation. You're trying to see how something is going to work out. You could be dating somebody new here. Could be a Gemini. Okay, why is entertainment here? You enjoying some? Oh, Bible swords. Hmm. So you could be entertaining a certain situation in love. That's. Hmm. It could be in secret, or it could be um forbidden for some of you. Could be forbidden. Hmm. Let's find out more with this five of swords. Some type of entertainment <sighs> could come with a little surprise here. Why is the five of swords here with entertainment? We're going to go and get this out the way. Oh, wait, there it go. Okay, so this entertain you could be entertaining someone or interacting with someone, Sagittarius. And it has a lot to do with the do, okay? It has a lot to do with the do. Okay, I can't talk how I normally talk on here, y'all, because YouTube don't be playing, y'all. YouTube do not be playing. So this could have to do with the do, okay? The do could be the main, you know what I'm saying? It could be the main uh, theme of this connection, okay? Okay? There's some type of, this could be two different people, but I feel like this is someone here 
that is mainly after the do, you know, they just want to entertain something. That's it. Nothing, nothing serious. Okay. If that's not what you want, I suggest, mm -hmm, look, the six of pentacles in reverse. This person does not want to balance something out with you. It's like, it's just, it's, it's like I'm here for a good time, not a long time. It's what I'm getting here. You could have had this idea about somebody. I feel like you, you could have the idea that someone is only in it for the entertainment. They're only in it for a fun time, but not to have something serious, not to build an empire or no, nothing like that. Okay. This is just for a good time. Why is the lovers here with dessert? Let's find out if this is two different. Oh, wow. Okay. So this could be two different people in your energy because you got the queen of cups here with dessert. Someone feels as though you're very delicious, uh, Sagittarius. You're very delicious. You're very attractive. You're, you're very kind. You're very sweet, uh, Sagittarius. And I feel like whatever situation this is, this person could see that. They could see that, okay, you're dessert. You know, you're, you're, you're nice. You know, you're kind. You're sweet. You're loving. And someone could take it. They could try to take advantage of that. So just be on the lookout, Sagittarius, for any signs or anything that signifies that a person could be using you or just not as serious about about you as you are about them or about life or whatever. So why is healing here? Because I see you healing. I feel like through healing, you became more attractive. Yeah, seven of swords. I feel like you're you're healing a lot of past betrayal, a lot of past hurts. It's like you're coming to terms with a lot of things that took place in your past, uh, Sagittarius, and things are looking better for you. A lot of the things that you've had to heal with has come from like some type of betrayal here. So you definitely don't want this if this is not what you're after. If you're not after just, you know, something temporary, then I suggest you don't engage in this. But you can do whatever you want to do because, I mean, it's your choice. It depends on what phase of your life that you're in, Sagittarius. But it looks like you've done a lot of healing on yourself regarding situations like this. OK, regarding betrayals, regarding um, s someone not being truthful with you, someone not, you know, value valuing you. Like this doesn't have any empathy in it, and I don't feel like this does either. This is just about the, a good time. This is this is about, OK, I have fun with you. I vibe with you, but I don't want to give any more to this situation than this one here. I don't want to give any more to the situation than this one. Why is internal work here? Because I feel like you've done too much work for that type of energy. But it depends on who you are and where you are in your life as well. Everyone is different. You have the sun. You've done a lot of work on yourself, Sagittarius. And so with that being said, I feel like you don't really want to waste time. Like you want something more authentic. That's what I'm getting. Yeah, you got the world here with with healing and the seven of swords like you've healed a lot of things here. And I see the king of swords at the bottom of the deck. So you've healed a lot of things, uh, Sagittarius, regarding your love life, regarding your emotions, regarding betrayal, regarding some type of lies and um, something dealing with communication. You've healed a lot dealing with that. And it looks like someone isn't being honest with you about what they want to give to this situation here with entertainment. And I don't feel like you have time for that because with this internal work with the sun, it's like you're moving on um, into a more beautiful phase of your life, a more authentic and genuine phase of your life where you're accepting yourself. And you don't want anyone coming in with any phony energy. And I feel like this could be phony energy or you could see this as phony energy because I don't see this person being honest with you about where they're coming from or where they're going here this person could like um not really say what's what or what's next you know because it's like they're in the moment and that's it it's nothing more than that for this for this person here okay this could be a sagittarius leo aries look at that internal work with the five of pentacles yeah you've done too much work to go back to being in the five of pentacles okay sagittarius you've done too much this could be a Sagittarius, a Virgo, a Leo. This could be a Sagittarius, Virgo, Leo here. 
And on this side with dessert and healing, this could be a, a Gemini, a Libra, Aquarius. A, a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or Scorpio. Why is fate here with idea? You had some type of idea. Something has come to you about a situation. Something has come to the light. You have a, under, a better understanding. Oh, you got the King of Pentacles. Ooh. You, hmm, oh my. So uh, a lot of you are figuring out where you want to be, what you want to do, or who you want to do it with, okay? Something is fate. Hmm. Wow, let's go ahead and pull some oracle for this. Let's pull some yin and yang for this. I see these kings here. You have two kings and you have a queen on the board with the lovers. So this is definitely. It's like you have a choice between two, two people here. You have the choice to have fun or you have a choice. You have the choice to be more stable. Okay. I mean, we always have cho we always have choices, but it looks like you want to do both. But it's like in one of them, it's more serious. I feel like it's more serious here. But I feel like if you choose fun over something more serious, you're going to end up disappointed. You, you're going to feel like you, the internal work that you've done didn't lead anywhere. Just back into this five of pentacles. And I know you don't want that. You just got to get creative, okay? I, this is what I'm feeling. It's time for you to get creative with this idea because you got the idea card. Okay, let's get some uh, Gang Gang Oracle for this. Thank you so much for joining this reading, you guys. Make sure you like this video. Drop me a comment down below. And, of course, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Oh, my goodness. What is this? Mm -hmm. Sagittarius, are you missing somebody? Because what just flew out is separation and longing. Are you missing someone? Because something just flew out here in, with separation and longing. Okay, and you have release, surrender. Oh my. So, who, whatever you're missing, whatever you're separated from, okay, it's time for you to just let it go and let it stop controlling you. Let it stop, you know, stopping you from getting things done here with this King of Pentacles. This could be a King of Pentacles. This could be a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus that you're in separation from. Sagittarius, um, you miss this person a lot. Um, let's let's pull another one because I, I just feel like whoever this is, this person makes you feel very comfortable here with the King of Pentacles. Okay, this person makes you feel very comfortable. Let's pull one more. Tell me more about this King of Pentacles situation here because you're missing someone and it's like you feel like you need to release someone. I don't know if you feel like you need to release one of these options here. Oh, got two of them. Okay, you have rejection, loss, fragmented. Oh my goodness. Change and courage. You feel rejected by somebody here. Somebody that you're in separation from. Let's go ahead and clarify this to get more clarity on this situation. Why is the lovers? Why is the lovers here with the Queen of Cups with dessert? the lovers here with the queen of cups you got the queen of pentacles mm -hmm. oh my sag you got you got the queen of pentacles here with the king of pentacles 
So you could be in separation from someone here. Someone that you you were very close to. Um someone that you felt comfortable with in their energy, like you felt comfortable in the physical is what I'm saying, like to physically be near this person. You could be separated from this person. <laughs> I feel like for some of you, you're separated from someone that you know you want to be with. I do, especially with this Queen of Pentacles coming back, coming out with the Queen of Cups with the lovers. I feel like you're separated from someone. And this could this could not just be physical, but I'm getting that it's physical for a lot of you. This could be uh, physical. This could be emotional. But I feel like you're separated from someone that you know you want to be with. Like, you know you want to be with this person. But, like, you're pulling back. Like, you're, you're kind of running in a way, not probably physically not actually literally but it's like you're running from the connection that you know know you want it's almost like you're rejecting yourself from this person it's like it's like it's like this person wants you but it's like you've been so hurt with this healing and and all of that that although you've healed a lot of things you still haven't come to terms with that okay this person actually cares for me there's someone who actually cares for you. Tell me more about this entertainment, five of swords, six of pentacles in reverse with the knight of wands. Because on this side, you have someone who, who is like about to do, okay? And that's it. Like they don't want to give back to a situation. They don't want any type of stability. At least not yet. You got the king of cups. Ooh, at least not yet. Ooh, Sagittarius, Sagittarius, Sagittarius. What is going on here? Because you have a, a King of Cups. Um, oh my goodness, you got the King. Of, oh my goodness, Sagittarius. I, I have to. I have to tell you what was what's coming up here. I have to tell you what's coming up here. I see this King of Pentacles in the middle. Okay, and I feel like Sagittarius. You feel like this is your other half, but it's like. This person has hurt you in the past. This person has caused some type of pain to you, some type of betrayal. And you felt the need to walk away. You and this person could have made amends, but you're still holding on to something from the past, some type of rejection, loss, um, some type of separation and hurt and pain that you went through with this King of Pentacles here. But then you have a King of Cups. And I feel like this King of Cups was once a Knight of Wands. This, 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 this Knight of Wands ain't, ain't the Knight of Wands anymore. OK, this Knight of Wands is turning into the King of Cups and you have the Queen of Cups here. You're showing up as the Queen and King of Cups and the King, Queen of Pentacles and Cups. You're showing up as the King, as the King of Pentacles and, the, and Cups and Swords. And you're also showing up as the Queen of Swords, Pentacles and Cups. But you have someone here who was once about to do and this person is about to drop a bomb on you. OK, this person is about to drop a bomb on you because this ain't just fun no more for this person. Something has changed. Something has changed, uh, Sagittarius, with this entertainment, with this person. This person doesn't see this as just fun no more. OK, this person has been enlightened about a certain situation because this person is the king. They're showing up as the king of cups. They're, they're showing up as if they have some type of feeling, some type of emotions for you. Uh, Sagittarius, it's time to pull out some hidden truth. Tell me more about this king of cups. What does this king of cups want to communicate? What is hidden? What is hidden here with this King of Cups with entertainment? Because, oh my, this person done had a change of heart here. They went from the Knight of Wands. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I hear who I really am from you. So this is someone who gets down with the get down. But they got a big old heart that they don't like to share. So this person made it seem like it was about the entertainment. Mm. Sagittarius, this person made it seem like it was about the entertainment. Mm -mm. It, that, that changed. It was too fun, Sagittarius. It was too fun. They wanted to keep it. <laughs> they wanted to keep it, Sagittarius. What is going on here? I see two different people. I see a King of Cups and a King of Pentacles. 
and the king of swords. We ain't gonna, we ain't gonna go there. We ain't gonna go. <laughs> we ain't gonna go there. I see two people. I see three, but I see two. I see three, but I see two. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Let's go ahead and finish clarifying this energy. Okay, you got the king of swords with the world and the seven of swords. Tell me more about this. With healing. Ooh, someone wants to make amends. Someone wants to make amends with you. Tell me more about this king of swords with the word, the seven of swords with healing. Someone wants to make amends with you, Sag. Tell me more about this. I feel like someone wants to make amends with you after something ended. Something ended and now someone wants to make amends. Like, what do they want to make amends about? What does this have to deal with? Tell me more about this. The Ten of Wands. Hmm. A cycle completed itself and someone wants to make amends. You've done a lot of work on yourself too, uh, Sagittarius. Tell me more about the Ten of Wands. Someone wants to come back around. Yeah, Four of Cups in reverse. Someone is, is changing their mind about something. And I feel like it's this King of Cups. Someone is changing their mind about something. This could be a Libra, Gemini. This could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Tell me more about the sun with the five of pentacles with internal work. Oh, shit. You got the ace of cups. Oh, my goodness, Sagittarius. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. You've done the work. You've done the in, in, internal work. That you needed to do to heal a lot of things, to heal this situation, and you did. And you did. Sagittarius, I feel like this King of Cups here that was once a Knight of Wands. Well, I ain't gonna say they were once a Knight of Wands. They're still the Knight of Wands. But they didn't share with you this King of Cups energy uh, side of them because they were afraid of being hurt because they had been in this Five of Swords energy. Okay? This person hid who they who they really were from you, Sagittarius. They hid who they really were from you. Let's get the overall energy of this reading. What's the overall energy of this reading? What is the best outcome of this reading? What is the best outcome for Sag? What is the best outcome? Oh, my goodness. The Six of Cups. Who is this? Somebody wants to make amends. Someone wants to spend the block and come back around and try something again. Okay. Tell me more about the Six of Cups. Someone wants to try something again with you. Oh, what's this? Oh. You got the Three of Pentacles. Mm. This could definitely be dealing with a third party two people two other people and you have the queen of swords you spoke a truth about something okay tell me more about the six of cups to the three of pentacles what's the six of cups to the three of pentacles somebody wants to collaborate with you and work something out with you Someone wants to double back, backtrack, and do something different, try a different plan, put something else together, try something new, try something different this time around. You got justice. Yeah, someone wants to try something new. Someone wants to correct something with you. Ooh. Someone wants to correct something with you. Tell me more about this uh, Three of Pentacles to the Queen of Swords. Someone could be telling you this or about to tell you what they want out of a connection with you. Tell me more about this. You got the King of Wands in reverse. Ooh, wee, there you go. Mm. Someone could be coming forward telling you how they truly feel about a certain situation, about a third party situation, or how they want to move forward with you. They want to balance something out with you. Tell me more about the Queen of Swords to the Page of Pentacles. 
someone feels like this will be a very difficult thing to do. Someone is having a hard time approaching you, Sagittarius, because you come off as the Queen of Swords. Yeah, the lovers in reverse. There it is. Um, you come off as the Queen of Swords. Um, they're afraid of some type of rejection here. They're afraid of losing. They're afraid of being betrayed in this five of swords. Tell me about justice to the king of wands. Justice to the queen, queen of wands. I mean the king of wands in reverse. If someone has changed their mind, this um, this king of wands. See this knight of wands here. I feel like this could definitely be this king of wands. What is this? Feel like this knight of wands could be this king of wands you got the two of swords in reverse tell me more about the king of wands to the lovers in reverse there's some type of decision someone is having a hard time making a decision to come towards you about this ten of cups about this uh new beginning this happy ending someone wants to have some type of family dynamic with you someone wants more like this king i feel like this is this king of cups um sagittarius i feel like you're dealing with someone who was like in and out here in the past, uh, Sagittarius, it really seemed like all this person wanted to do was just have a good time with you. But in the midst of that, this this King of Cups has gained some type of feelings, some type of love for you that they they hid. They tried to keep it hidden. This person is trying to hide how they feel. This person is having a hard time keeping that a secret. Tell me more about the Two of Swords in reverse to the Ten of Cups. This person is having a hard time keeping this a secret, Sagittarius. They cannot hold back any no longer, Knight of Cups, but they're having a hard time coming forward because this is still the night. It's like this person is coming. They just need you to be patient, but you don't have time to wait. It's what I'm getting, Sagittarius. You don't have time to wait. Overall, this person is having a hard time. There is someone having a hard time coming forward with you about who they really are. Okay, Sagittarius, they're having a hard time coming forward about who they really are, Sagittarius, because of how you show up. You show up as a queen or a king. You show up as someone. You got the queen of swords, the king of swords, the queen of pentacles, the king of pentacles, the queen of cups, the king of cups, Sagittarius. You have the ten of cups and the knight of cups. Someone knows that they will have the ten of cups with you. Someone knows that with you, they will be very happy and very pleased uh, Sagittarius, but they're afraid of some type of rejection. This person could be staying away from you. I see this King of Pentacles in the middle, surrounded by the fragment, the release and all of that. And this person feels that I feel like this. I'm picking up on someone else's energy. I'm picking up on yours, but I'm also picking up on someone else's energy here. I feel like this person is also not coming towards you. I feel like this person is not coming towards you or you feel as though this person isn't coming towards you because this person is ultimately in the Knight of Cups and this person is having a hard time coming towards you. They see the Ten of Cups with you, Sagittarius. It looks like something is fate. Something is bound to happen. Someone is coming coming uh, towards you, is, is coming forward, but they're coming at a very, very slow pace. Uh, they're very emotional about the situation. They're having a hard time making a decision to come towards you. This person is is torn between staying stuck and staying stagnant in their head here with the two of swords in reverse or just coming towards this ten of cups where they know where their ten of cups is, uh, Sagittarius, and that is with you. Wow, Sagittarius. Oh, my goodness. that That's very, very intense. Uh, Sagittarius, thank you so much for tuning into this reading. This is the Sagittarian Goddess, and I will see you all in the next reading.